guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day so far. So for today's video, I'm just going to be showing you guys a couple of things that I have been using in the month of June that I have just been loving and I'm going to keep it nice and short and sweet. So let's just jump right into it. So the first thing I have here is a shampoo and it's from the brand OGX. I ran out of my Moroccan oil shampoo from this brand and I went to repurchase it but when I went to the store I saw this one which is the nourishing coconut milk shampoo and it just really caught my attention because I love the scent of coconut and the whole coconut milk just sounded like it was very nourishing and would give me some nice smoothness to my, to my hair. And what it says is indulge your senses with this exclusive blend of coconut milk to nourish your hair with ultra whipped egg white proteins, add strength and elasticity along with weightless coconut oils to add hydration and balance. So I was really intrigued when I saw it and again the coconut smell um, grabs my attention so I absolutely love this shampoo it's not expensive and it's really good it leaves my hair so soft and the scent is just amazing um, the brand is really good because the Moroccan one was also great so highly recommend this um, shampoo if you're looking for something new to wash your hair with um, the next thing that I wanted to mention are these face masks from Bio Republic, and I got these in my Ipsy bag and they're just awesome face masks. This cucumber one is just amazing. It is so cooling and so refreshing. I absolutely enjoyed um, wearing this mask so much. Once It's like the Sephora ones if you've ever tried them. It comes in the shape of a face and you just put the mask on your face and you leave it on for 15 to 20 minutes and then whatever's left on your face, you just rub it into your face and continue with your skincare routine. I really recommend this cucumber one if you spent the day at the beach or at the pool or outside all day and maybe you got a sunburn because it is so, so cooling and refreshing and hydrating. I just loved it so much and they're so inexpensive, only about $5. You can get it on Amazon or Walmart. I'm really excited to try the pomegranate one which is supposed to help with like brightening your skin and stuff like that. They both have vitamin E and they're for all skin types loving these masks it's just wonderful to give yourself a nice spa moment the next skincare item i want to talk about is this little super spot remover from orange origins and it's this tiny little bottle right here and this tiny little thing is so potent and i've been wanting to buy it for so long and i don't know why i never did because it's so inexpensive it's only about 16 bucks but this little thing works really really well um you just apply a little bit of it on any like blemish or breakout that you may have gotten and I want to say within two days of you using this your blemish is definitely dried up and way smaller a lot of people say that they put it on and like when they wake up it's gone I'm not gonna say that it works that super quickly but it definitely works and it definitely helps shrink and dry up your blemishes and it's supposed to also work for dark spots which is another reason why I picked it up and I am very happy with this product. It does burn when you put it on. Well, at least it burns me. But like within a minute, it goes away. Um, and also, if you leave a lot, like some product on, because sometimes I don't rub it completely into my skin. I like to leave product just like sitting on the blemish. It will dry up and you'll see like dried up flakiness. So if you're going to step out of the house, I wouldn't recommend using it that way. Other than that, it doesn't show up on the face if you like rub it in. So I have been loving this. Again, it's the Super Spot Remover from Origins. The next skincare item I want to talk about is from Josie Marin and it's her 100% Pure Argan Oil in Light. And I am in love with this oil. I have never felt my skin so smooth than when I started using this. It is just amazing. I first started using this into my nighttime routine but then I started using it as a primer um, under my makeup like to, to help smooth and it is so amazing. I just love this thing and I was always scared to incorporate oil into my skincare because I have oily skin but this oil just sets into your face so fast. It is so lightweight. It doesn't have a scent. It doesn't leave me feeling greasy at all and it is just amazing. I absolutely love it. Once I'm finished with this little sample size, I am definitely going to be rebuying, um, well not rebuying, but I'm going to buy the, the full size bottle because I just love how this makes my face feel. It is so smooth, like ridiculously smooth and I am just obsessed with it. I love how my foundation looks on top of it and I just love how my face feels when I wear it like um, as my skincare routine. It's just great. 
so I really recommend that um, if you're looking for a good oil. I don't know how the original one works, but this light one is awesome sauce. The next one, I, the next skincare item I want to talk about is this fresh soy conditioning eye makeup remover. And I use this when I get out of the shower because when I'm wearing a lot of liner or a lot of mascara, once I get out the shower, I still have like some black residue. So what I do is I just put some of this in a cotton pad and it's just like a white lotion and I clean up my eyes and it does the trick and it doesn't burn it doesn't leave under my eye looking greasy or anything like that and it's very gentle and smells like cucumber so I just love this thing and I've been using this forever and I always forget to mention it in my favorites I love this thing it's really really good and it also takes off waterproof mascara um, for those of you who like to wear waterproof makeup okay the next thing I wanted to mention is this NYX matte liquid liner this liner is so amazing it is so black it dries up matte and it has this teeny teeny thin um, applicator which helps you do such a nice crisp straight um, wing you definitely have to have a steady hands because it is so thin you can easily like mess up but this liner is just so amazing and so rich and black I just love it I have it on today it's awesome and it's so cheap definitely recommend it and then i also wanted to mention this um eye curl from mac in the color costa riche i'm wearing it in my lower lash line today this just gives you such a nice like sultry look without having to go and wear something so deep um as black and i have it swatched here for you guys already and it's like a reddish brown color and it's just so pretty and so sultry looking and it also complements the new shadows that I picked up from MAC, the orangey reddish tone ones. So I have been giving it a lot of use lately um, to go with that as well. So I am loving this. Definitely good um, if you don't want to be so dark with the black liner. And then lastly guys, I just wanted to mention the nail polish that I have been wearing all month long, especially on my toes, just retouching and retouching. Um, and it is from Essie and it is in the shade Tuck It In My Tux and it is just so pretty. It's a neutral color but it stands out just not in a loud way like a pink or orange would stand out. I just love this color. It's just so nice. Um, I do apply like three coats to get like the nice rich color I want um, but other than that it's just such a nice nail polish for the summertime. I have been loving it. So that completes this video guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. If you're a new subscriber, thanks so much for subscribing. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will catch you all in my next one. Bye guys.